What's up, everyone? Welcome to the 11th episode of Cartoon Fight Night. I'm your host, GH3, and if you're new to this series, be sure to check out the first episode. But if you know how the game is played, then let's get ready for the fight. Tonight's episode was animated by Evilist Ryu, so if you enjoy what you see, check the link down below. And that's right, for tonight's battle, we have a fight between Devil Jin and Ryu Hayabusa. If you want to see a review of Devil Jin, I recommend watching Evil Ryu. Ryu vs Devil Jin located on the Animation Rewind channel. And since Ryu Hayabusa is new to the Cartoon Fight Club and Cartoon Fight Night series, I am going to do a pre-analysis review of Ryu Hayabusa. Ryu was born into the Dragon Lineage Legacy. He was trained from childhood to walk the path of a ninja, killing his enemies without mercy, executing them with calculated attacks. As a child, Ryu learned many helpful survival skills under the guidance of Omitsu, the caretaker of the Hayabusa clan. Ryu is stated as being the most powerful ninja in the world. His speed and acrobatic skills are beyond exceptional. He is strong enough to wield hefty weapons and still maintain his agility. He is a master at hand-to-hand -hand combat and weaponry, particularly his swordsmanship skills. His main weapon is known as the Dragon Sword. Ryu specialized in martial arts known as the Hayabusa style ninjutsu. Ryu is able to move at lightning speeds and his reflexes are faster than a bullet. With his key manipulation, Ryu is able to use intense meditation and spiritual training to manipulate the laws of nature with his mind, appearing as magic no Known as the Ninja Art of Ninpo. With Ninpo, Ryu has learned the art of Fire Wheels, Flames, Phoenix, Inferno, Ice Storm, Hurricane, Wind Blades, Vacuum Wave, Divine Life, and Piercing Void. He has a wide range of weapons including his Dragon Sword, Lunar Staff, Warhammer, Bow and Arrow, and much more. Overall, Ryu is a very skilled and tactical ninja with a wide range of weapons. Although Ryu is a very skilled fighter, he has high respect for his opponents and enemies. Let's not waste any time and get straight into the fight. This fight will take place on Earth with no prep time. Let the battle begin. Get ready for the next battle. Get ready for the next battle. battle. And the winner is Devil Jin. But before we discuss why, I have a huge shout out to the battle animator Evilist Ryu. If you enjoyed it, please check his link down below. We know that Ryu has a wide range of weapons and is very skilled in hand-to-hand -hand combat, but Ryu doesn't stand a chance against Jin in his devil form. Devil Jin is able to fly and shoot lasers which allows him to keep his distance in a fight. Devil Jin knows how to take a hit. Jin in his base form was able to survive an explosion that put a crater in a mountain. Compared to his base form, Devil Jin is much more powerful and durable. He is also capable capable of lifting over 80 tons in his base form, which means he can lift more in his devil form. Keep in mind that Devil Jin's laser attack is capable of demolishing an entire castle in seconds, and was used to slice a beast the size of a mountain made out of spirits in half. A human being like Ryu wouldn't survive a blast from Devil Jin's lasers, and that's why the winner of tonight's fight is Devil Jin. Quick reminder, 
Be sure to check back on the main channel for Classic Sonic vs Kid Goku. Now if you want to see a rematch with Base Jin, all you have to do is like this video. If this video gets 3000 likes, there will be a rematch on the Cartoon Fight Night channel. Also, don't forget to comment down your own ideas and stay tuned as I reveal the next fighters. On the next episode of Cartoon Fight Night.